Welcome to Mike's Beer Channel on YouTube. Today, we're trying Prison Pals. <laughs> okay, so in all fairness, which, which video did you decide you were going to release first? This one or the one we just did? This one's going to be first. Okay, so this is going to be our inexpensive singles, These right? Are, oh, Compared this, to the other one. This is an inexpensive. No, that's single. cheap. <laughs> okay, but anyhow, Prison Pals is a brewery. In Durrell, Florida. And Where the heck is that? Durrell, Durrell? Florida? It's in the... You don't know, do you? I don't know I think know it's either. down by Lauderdale. Anyhow, we're trying... We think this is called... Oh, this is called Verano. It's uh, pretty in pink, but also pretty delicious. Local Florida hibiscus flowers is where they get the pink. And of course... Is it D-O-R-A-L? D-O-R-A-L. Oh, yes. Wow. Um, so this is the pink lager. You, you are right. It is on the Atlantic Coast, a little closer to Miami. Yeah. And we think this one is called Ha, because we can't tell. But this Yeah, it is, looks like Ha. Uh, ha. This says, taste freedom, escape your prison. Now, I saw a thing on, on some social media platform. Hang on. Uh-huh. Where they took a can, and they took another can, and they went like this. Oh my god, did you get it? No. Oh, 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 there you did. Although, it took a little... Um, that was a lot of work. Yeah. Let me just try. Okay, that doesn't work. Well, I mean, like, with practice, maybe. Someone lied to me. All right. And I... <laughs> Remember that guy who used to smash cans on his forehead? I wonder what ever happened to him. I don't know. He probably thinking, gave himself a concussion. I think he got brain damage or something. Maybe. All right. So this is pink lager. It is pink. It's pink. Well. Not, not a very good pink, but it's... You know, the first splash looks pink and the foam looks kind of pink, but it doesn't look so pink afterwards. No? No. Okay. Pink lager. 4.5% alcohol. Drink responsibly. So I was looking up trying to get the name of the other one. Yeah. And it just shows the picture, so it doesn't say what it's called. I, I think it's ha. Ha? Ha! Ha 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 ha! Wow, that was loud. It's okay. just a premium lager. Now see, the only thing I'm concerned with on these craft Loggers, these loggers are hard to really. Loggers are really hard to spruce up and craft beer. Like, mm. I mean, I've had some good loggers. I've had some loggers that were good, but they weren't that impressive. Well, I think one of the things that makes them the most appealing to try for the first time, at least, oh. is the design on the can. True. I mean, oh. because a lot of the times that's what we're shopping for. Mm. Once we've gotten mm. past, like, certain names that we've heard of before. So, like, the pink lager, while well, that was intriguing. Yes, it is. We've never had a pink lager before. No. There's a flamingo. I'm getting a little skunk. It is a little skunky. There's some skunk, and skunk doesn't mean it's bad. Everyone thinks skunk is bad. Skunk's not necessarily bad. Well, we used to think skunk was bad too, but then we started some... drinking. We drank a lot more international beers because yeah. in in Asia and Africa, skunk is good. Hmm. Ooh, it's got an interesting flavor at the end. So I read that pink lagers sometimes are made pink. With natural juices like beet juice. I'm thinking that might be what this is. Well, they said something about a hibiscus flower. Oh. I wasn't listening oh, to okay. you apparently. They said something about a hib I there's a there's a taste after it. Hmm. It's like a sweet It's oh you um um that fun dip. You remember the fun dip stuff? Uh huh. You get the hard candy thing and you dip it. Make that gesture again. <laughs> you dip it. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, yeah. He just turned, like, kids candy into something so foul. Really? <laughs> but that's the taste I get at the end. Uh -huh. It's like sugary. Sweet. I don't think it's all that sweet. What's something? It's it's a sweetness, but it's more like a... It's more like a sucking the juice out of a honeysuckle sweet than a sugar candy sweet. I never sucked a honeysuckle, so I don't know what that wow. means exactly. What's a honeysuckle? Really? It's a flower, It's right? a flower, and it, it has like this syrupy honey stuff in it. And you pull like the stem out, and it's coated with it, and you just suck it off, and it's uh, so good. Okay, is that an up north thing? You're from up north. Okay, let me explain something to you. Yeah, I don't think that they grow in Florida very well. We grew up in the same area, but my area was different than your area. Because there's mountains in well, between. Well, my area is different than your area now, and we live in the same place. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh. Before you move on, I just have to say, I really like this pink lager. It's very tasty. I like, I like, I like the taste afterwards. It's, it, this this is unique. It is. This has a unique flavor that you can't get and from after this. trying how many beers have we tried? We go a lot. Uh, hundred. Yeah. 500. I think we're at five something. I've never tasted anything like this. No, it's definitely different. So that's definitely going to help it help it yeah. in times for num time for numbers. I picked it out, by the way. I'm just saying. And she picked this one out, too. Yeah. Actually, well, it was right next to it, so. Hmm. Plus, the other two that I picked out were so expensive that I thought, like, we needed to Ooh. cheap it out for this trip. A little. I still smell a little skunk, but not a lot. This is kind of unique, too. Maybe it's eight to eight. Well, it looks like the touch is there. It does. And what's age age mean? I don't know. Huh. But it isn't very funny. I don't know. But this is man this is a serious craft brewer because these labels have these are have labels on them. They're not printed on the can. This one is good too. Honestly, I could totally drink both of these beers. I mean this like, one is good. I start the video by talking smack about lagers. These are both good. It does have a little Unique. bit of a floral something. That's got a similar. It. It's got a similar aftertaste. But it's, not as sweet. It's not as sweet and not as strong. But it's, it's still naturally sweet, not like mm. super sugary sweet. And these both taste like they use top notch ingredients. These, these are good. And these are good for a whole. These. Plus, we it's, can actually afford to drink this, like, you know, right, more than one occasionally. Right. Especially this one. This is unique. This is a lager that actually is different than a mass-produced lager. This is, because craft beer lagers are traditionally good, but they're not great. So, did we figure out if that was brewed for, for cancer awareness or not? No. It's for the, the hibiscus flower. It's, it's for the pink. flower. Yeah. So, this... This company, this the brewery, whatever. Prison Palace? Prison, this brand. They have a bunch of different stuff that we need to find and try. Okay. They have um, they have two hazy IPAs, at least. Ooh, I like hazy IPAs. There's a Ha Stout. Ooh, you like a stout. There's a, an IPA King. Ooh, a is juicy that a... IPA Hakuna Matata. Hakuna Matata. Um, the King out there's there's a wheat ale with mango oh i like wheat goat 10 what the heck premium mean? lager these are the only two from there at, at total wine though right? ipa goat ipa goat that's ball well that's balls. you know greatest of all time yeah, right i know that's, that's a ball i'm thinking well after tasting their lagers i definitely need to taste more because these are good there's an amber lager la colorada there's a blonde Dorada Pompiana. This sounds like a road trip. <gasps> we could do a road trip. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of excited about this. We definitely have to take note and it's try more. three hours away. <laughs> three, oh, yeah. Anyhow, if you like... So these, which one do you like better of these two? It's tough, right? 
The pink? I like the pink better. It's more unique. Yeah. We've drank over 500 beers, and this is different. Never had any, anything like this it. This is different than anything we've had. This is good, but it's not new unique. Now, if you drink regular beer, you're... I don't know. I think this is a little unique, too. Huh. It tastes like a lager, but it also tastes a little floral, natural sweetness. It does have some Something kind notes. of fresh... I don't know how else to describe it. Either way, I absolutely 100% say man or woman, no matter really what, good. if you like any kind of beer whatsoever, try both of these. See, this has a little bit of sour to it. I mean, all the IPAs that are out there, are, you know, well, I'm going to taste some when we get them. A lot but, of IPAs taste the same. But IPA, IPA, we, we all know how I feel about IPAs. But it's rare that a craft brewery can pull off lager that's actually craft. That's actually like, wow. And at this point, it's rare that we find a beer that we find completely unique. It is true. And so, I like, like, both of these are something different than I feel like. I mean, what did you compare them to? Did you have anything to compare either one of these I can't to? compare this to anything because it's unique. What about the other ones? This one I would compare to because... To the best lager that I believe I haven't I didn't go back through the book to look, but Founders has a lager mm -hmm. that was really good. Had a little bit of citrus to it though. This does not. So this is more. This, I, that's the only thing I can think. That's my top lager rating wise. This is really good. So if anybody knows this stuff and knows what it's actually called, if it's really called ha or called something else, please tell us because we hate to get it wrong. But, you know, we also don't do enough research because this is really for fun and entertainment and not for This isn't how we're going to retire. Else. No, definitely not. I feel bad because I was going to think we have a subscriber that is just a total stranger. I forgot to write his name down. I wanted to thank him for subscribing. Oh, well, well, well I that's I got a cool. notification and everything. I hope he's watching this video. I wonder if he's friends with that one that you subscribed to that was local here recently. I don't know. Maybe. Is it a new subscriber? Yeah. Oh, cool. Well, hey, thank I'm you. I'm up to 82. Thank you to anybody who has subscribed to 90, watch us be idiots. 90, I need more beer glasses. Oh, mm -hmm. more beer glasses. More beer glasses. You still don't really actually have beer glasses. I've got the two. Okay, anyhow. Whew, let's stop. Okay. Collaborate and listen. Oh, my Ooh. God. Please, Mike. Hang on, hang on. Don't. I don't want to get copyrighted or something. Anyhow, I like the pink one better. I'm going 99 because it's unique. It's, it is. It's totally different. I have never tasted another beer that tastes like that. This one is good, but I think I'm going like 96. Okay. I'm, I'm cool with both of those because... Because it's, it's good and it's kind of unique, but this one, I've never tasted anything like it. Uh, yeah, I agree. I should probably rank it higher than that, but we are trying to be a little more... Trying to be a little more... And it is literally Stupid. kind of pink. It is kind of pink. Doesn't match the can though. No, well, it's not quite that anyhow. pink. Anyhow, but if you can find these, you should try them. If you find other beers by this brewery, Prison Pals, you should try it because these are delicious. And we're I'm definitely not... going to try some more when we find them. Yeah, and I don't get paid to say this. No, <laughs> this wasn't a sponsored video or anything. Nope. It was just us. But these are delicious. Looking at the single cans in the store and yep. going, hmm. Anyhow. That's why he brings me because I pick out stuff that he went in and picked out. She picks out stuff that I don't. Yeah. That happens all the time. And he spends more money when I I'm with him. I spend more money. Which is not good. If you want to spend more money at the store, I have to bring my wife or one of my kids. Because <laughs> if I buy myself, I don't. If I buy myself. Wow. <laughs> How much have you had to drink? Well, it this isn't been that the first much. video we shot. No, but you know, it's only the second and... Well, well, yeah, okay. Anyhow, like, subscribe. So that adds up to two total beers. We won't talk about the percentage of alcohol, but two total beers that you've had to drink. That's it. Oh, and whatever other PBR you drink. I drank a whole PBR. Okay, three. But the first... Anyhow, like, subscribe, smash the <laughs> notification button. Until next time.